Hey everybody, it's Pastor Matt here, and, and this will be the last teaching episode today of 1724 Wise, Wisdom, Inspiration, Success, and Encouragement for Our Young Adults. And today, I want to just talk to you about honor. And I want to just briefly mention King David. We've talked about him three or four times over the last three or four weeks. And King David, when he was a young man, he was greatly favored and had great promotion. One of the principles in his life was he lived a life of honor. He honored his parents. He honored the king. Even when the king was not living honorably, David honored him. And David honored his friends. Uh, as a matter of fact, Jonathan was his closest friend. And David, his whole life, would live his life even after Jonathan died, even after King Saul died, David continued to honor those men the rest of his entire life. And of course, he gave great honor and respect to God. And I want to talk to you as we go into the summer, and, and hopefully you're going to have a lot of time with your friends. Hopefully you, you, you've made a lot of great friends over the last couple of years that are going to be lifelong friends. I want to talk to you about remembering to honor your creator. As a matter of fact, Proverbs tells us to honor your creator in the days of your youth, to honor your parents, as that's the first commandment with the promise that you'll live long on the earth, to honor those in authority. And we live in a day and an age where our nation is politically divided, and people tend to be very snippety and critical, and even in our, even uh, sometimes uh, mocking uh, people with no facts to back it up. I would encourage you you live a life of honor and uh, you live above that. And, and lastly, honor your friends. Uh, honor those ones that you want to be in your life the rest of, of your life. You know, the, the fact of the matter is, if you have five true friends at the end of your life, you've done better than most. And you're not going to find those true friends without a sense of honor. The Bible tells us if you want to have friends, you must first be friendly. And one of the ways you can be friendly is to honor, in other words, have respect for, and, 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 and not be always putting down, but sometimes actually building relationship. So as I close our teachings, I'm going to be back next week just to pray with you. But I want, you to, I want to encourage you, honor the people God has put in your life. And as you honor them, God will honor you. I'll talk to you next week.